Shalom and Bruchim Abayim. Welcome to Two Minutes of Torah. This uh, week we are starting a new book in the Torah, the book of Leviticus of Baikra. But also this coming Shabbat is a special Shabbat in our calendar. It's called Shabbat Achodesh, the Shabbat of the month, meaning the month of Nisan, because we will read in the Torah from the book of Exodus chapter 12. The chapter in which God announces to Moshe and Aaron while they are still in Egypt that the new month will be the first month for them. From now on you will count the months of the year not starting with Tishrei, the month in which the world was created, but with Nisan, the month in which you become a free people. The gift of time is the first sign that they are changing their status from being slaves to, bring, to being a free people. To have the opportunity to get the gift of time, to manage your own time, is the first sign and one of the most important signs that you are a free person. Of course, also announces the coming of the springtime. And if you live in Atlanta and you have been enjoying uh, the wonderful weather, the warm days, and also have been suffering from the pollen, uh, pollen count in our air, you know that you don't need the Torah to tell you to announce you that springtime is coming. So why do we need to read this? Ramban in the 13th century in Spain explains that the fact that the Torah says that this is a new month for you is talking to each one of us in every generation. Each generation gets the gift of time. And if we know how to balance our time between our work and our holidays, our family time, and our study time, if we know how to really appreciate the fact that we are masters of our own time, we can recommit with the idea that we are free individuals and a free people. I hope you will have a wonderful week and that you will join us celebrating this new month and reconnecting with this wonderful gift that we got as individuals and as the people. The gift of knowing that we are masters of our own time and of our own destiny. Have a wonderful week.